happy Friday. It is December the 11th. We have made it to another weekend. And this Friday actually matters. Last Friday was like not exactly a Friday because I had to work on Saturday. So um, yeah, this Friday is, it's Friday. We've made it to the end of the week and I have so much to do. <laughs> I have so much to do this weekend. Um, I, my voice sounds really tired, so I'm going to apologize for that really early on. I've tried to like get it woke up this morning, but it's all froggy, so please bear with me on my froggy voice this morning. But um, anyhow, I just, I mentioned it yesterday, just all the things I have to do. I'm just slightly feeling a little overwhelmed, um, and probably by slightly, I mean, I feel a lot overwhelmed. Um, so I'm fine, everybody. I really am. I just, I do it to my own self. And now it's time to just get it all done and I will and it'll be just fine but uh so yesterday I was like I am just I've got to write this stuff down like I just was thinking of everything I had to do between now and Christmas and I was like oh I'm gonna put off this little cute Christmas to-do list and that'll help me you know be a little more excited about all the things I have to do well I printed one off it's cute it's, oh, I got it. Um, it's cute. It's got little deer. It says Christmas to-do list. But as I started writing stuff down, I realized this is all this weekend. This weekend. You see, I scratched it out and wrote this weekend. Every single thing on this list is stuff I need to have done this weekend. I think there's maybe one thing on there that, like I said, I started writing like everything I need to do before Christmas. I'm like, no. All of this literally has to be done this weekend. So, busy night tonight. Um, I can say the things I'm doing because this won't go up till at least Saturday or maybe even Sunday. Uh, so, no spoilers for Aiden or anything. But, um, as soon as I leave work, I need to go pick up Scotty's Christmas present. I mentioned it was ready yesterday. I'm going to keep you on suspense all the way till Christmas. Um, and then... I have to go to Game Exchange and get some games for Aiden's DS. So you guys saw last night that we got Aiden a DS, a 2DS for his birthday. Tonight I'm going to go and get some games for it. He showed me a few last night that he apparently knows about. I don't know if maybe he has a friend that has one or what, but um, so I'm going to look for those. And I had planned all along to get him games. I just haven't made it over to Game Exchange because buying them new is dumb. It's like $35 for a game and you can buy them used for six or something so okay moving on moving on I'm trying not to talk about because I know I'm going to cover at least two to three days and I have a lot to do but you know I'm filling you in before it happens so that you know what's fixing to happen um and so I have to do that and um then I ordered some gifts on walmart.com last night that are going to be ready for pickup today so I got to go pick those up but while I'm at walmart I have to do a grocery shop and um, pick up like party decorations and the last few little bits that I need for the party snacks and drinks and whatnot I was gonna do a grocery pickup order, but that never happened. I just I had too many things to do. I went to bed Entirely too late last night, so I could not have done one more thing and that included a grocery pickup order so I got my little list my very short list of very short list of groceries right here. That's all I'm getting. I'm going to figure out pizza for dinner so that it's quick and easy and I don't have to cook. The kids, when they get home from school, they are going to clean house and start getting ready for the party. That takes some stuff off of me. When I get home, I'm going to bake a cake and I will film that so that you guys can see um, making a cake and decorating a cake. It's going to be so simple though. It's not going to be any fancy elaborate thing. He doesn't want a party theme really so I guess he does want a ripstick party but there's no decorations for that so I told him I was just gonna do red and black so I could just like draw a ripstick on the cake and happy birthday that would be good I'll do that so I gotta decorate for or decorate the cake and then I'll have till two o'clock tomorrow. Actually, till probably twelve thirty because I'll need to go pick up his friends. Um, and then I've got to get my house decorated for Christmas because I have to get those boxes out of my dining room before we have a party. Like, there's just no way our house is not big enough to have all the Christmas boxes 
and children gathered around the table. And it's going to be raining, and so we can't have this party outside like we had originally planned. Boo. So it's starting right now. It's 55 degrees. So let's do a weather update when I get out of work because the temperature is supposed to drop. It's supposed to rain all day. It's supposed to rain tomorrow. And then it's supposed to snow on Sunday. And it's like good chances right now. It's like 60% chance right now. So when you watch this, it'll probably be Sunday or Monday. So we'll know by then if it did snow. Anyway, okay, moving on. I have talked so long and so fast. It is enough. So I will check in with you guys later. Um, I don't, who knows when, what, I don't know, I don't know, so anyways, we'll, we'll catch back up later, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and yeah, bye. Hey there, I am off work, and I actually got off work kind of late, it's a little after five right now, um, and I'm at Walmart, and um, my plans have changed a little bit. I am completely exhausted for today, and so I am not going to go pick up Scotty's present, um, it's not going anywhere so um, I'm gonna cut that out I'm gonna get the thing I need from my Walmart pickup and then I'm gonna do my groceries and then um, game exchange doesn't close till 9 so I was gonna kind of pick this up then go to game exchange and go to the other place and then go back to Walmart and you know I'm just I'm exhausted so we had a really busy day at work today and we like broke a bunch of records for how much we could produce so shout out to my team you guys killed it today it was so 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 stinking exciting um and the best way possible to end a week so um my tired voice has continued I it never really cleared up from being froggy but my body hates me right now like I hurt everywhere and I just don't feel awesome which every time I wear myself out like this my body starts to like shut down or whatever but I really am fine I promise you guys um I somewhat know my limits like I definitely push them to the absolute max but um I know that once I get this stuff done tonight making the cake is really not that big of an issue um and then the party's not till two tomorrow so I can actually sleep in just a little bit and um also with the ending at four I'll have all evening to tomorrow to you know, fill it with other things I want to do. So, um, anyways, I really didn't want to talk this long, but just wanted to update you that some plans have changed, but yeah, so I'm gonna go into Walmart and get what I need from here. I really wish I didn't have to wear a mask. Like I am not even kidding. I, and I know for a fact I am oxygen deprived. Like I, I know I could go in here without a mask. Like I know tons of people do it. I'm just, I guess I'm a sheeple. You can call me that. I'm a rule follower and um, it is what it is right now and I'm doing what I can do. <sighs> yeah, I don't like confrontation so I don't want someone to come up to me and be like, you need to wear a mask, blah, blah, blah. Whatever. Anyways, I really don't want to talk about that but I just need to breathe. I need oxygen. I was sitting here for like three minutes with my windows down just so I could breathe. I drove over here with my windows down just so I could breathe. Um, wearing a mask all day is no joke. Like, doctors, nurses, those of you that do it all the time anyways, I praise you because we've been doing it for six months and it, I'm over it. <laughs> My body's over it. So anyway, that's it. I'm not trying to be a Debbie Downer, but that's it. Brighter things ahead. All right. Advent calendar time. Go for it, guys. I got a little car. Thanks. Nice. I bet you I can make it without even working. Is it open the others that haven't been opened yet? No. It's like opening all the ones that have been. Oh my goodness. What a mess. Another brush. Little, like, another little baby brush. It's like angry. Mm. You nice. haven't gotten a brush yet, have you? I think the very first thing was a brush. Huh? I think the very first thing she got was a brush. Oh, I thought she had all the... Oh, no. Okay. Hey, guys. It is uh, pretty late. It's 1045. Uh, let me tell you how tired I am. <laughs> 
last night when I was up, I was editing the video and I had to get the FCA video uploaded and stuff. I literally could not read my watch. I usually have an analog watch. Like I just, it would not click in my brain. So I changed my watch <laughs> to be a digital because I could not comprehend what time it was. And it's actually been very nice to have all day long. Um, but anyways, I have been doing a lot of Christmas decorating. Um, you can see the wall behind me. It's coming along. It's coming along. Um, Scotty is making me a stocking holder to put up, but I kind of like how this looks. So now I don't know where I'm going to put it, but, uh, I'm going to flip you around here in a second. Please tell me I am not the only one whose house looks like this when you Christmas decorate. So all the boxes there and the stockings, you probably don't have sleeping pups everywhere, but a ladder. The couch is not where it's supposed to be. All the decorations that came off the shelf are there. Sorry, the dog grate, but all the things that have to go back in the attic. I'm putting the stuff that is either fall that I don't have room for because I need to buy another tub or um, stuff that I'm taking down. There's more stuff I'm taking down right there. Um, and I went grocery shopping and there's toilet paper and paper towels that we were out of. So yeah, make me feel better about myself and tell me that your house looks like this whenever you're decorating for Christmas too. But I'm in a mad dash to get it done because Aiden's party's tomorrow. I've said this a million times. You already know. Sorry. Um, but I have to get it all put up so I can put all this in the back in the attic and get it out of the way so we can actually have people in our home tomorrow. Um, yeah, so I still have quite a bit of work ahead of me and I'm going to bake his cake tonight. So I'm fixing to actually start it so that it can be baking while I'm doing some more things. Um, I'm just taking down my tiered tray now. <laughs> it really breaks my heart, but I'm not going to put it up for Christmas because I don't have any more decorations that can go on it. I don't have any small decorations. Um, and then the last thing I wanted to say was I have decided to not do a decorate with me. I really wanted to, but I am just overwhelming myself by doing too much. And so trying to film and move my camera and have good angles and do all of that while I'm decorating is not working out for me. So what I will do is I'll probably do like a DIY for the tree that I had out there. And then I'm fixing to put together a tree for my Disney room. Um, but then the main thing I'm going to do is just like a Christmas decoration home tour. Um, just basically like I did at the end of my fall decorate with me and just kind of show you everything once it's done. Um, you're already getting sneak peeks of everything as I'm vlogging anyways. And so I think that's just what I'm going to do, especially this year. Um, there's just a lot right now. And I think that that's one thing I'm just going to cut out. So if you were excited about that, I'm sorry, let me know you were excited about it so that I won't skip it next year. Um, but yeah, I think that's just what's going to be best for me. Sorry, very unflattering angles. Um, but yeah, I'm really getting excited how it's coming together. And so I'll show you a full home tour in a day or two whenever I have my life back in order after this party. So I'm fixing to head to bed. I finally got the cake done, but, um, I mean, I have it flipped out and it's out of the pan and everything now, but, um, <laughs> I don't even know what happened to this cake, but I'm going to make it work. Uh, so it, it looks like sloth from <laughs> the Coonies or something. I, I really don't know what in the world happened, why it's all bubbled up on this side. I don't know if like all the baking soda like pulled in one. I have no idea. But anyway, it's not the prettiest, but I think what I'm going to do, because he wanted a ripstick birthday anyways. I think I talked about this in yesterday's vlog, um, but I couldn't find any decorations. So I was just going to do black and red. Excuse my mess of a kitchen. So I just got black and red tablecloths and then black and red plates and then black forks. Um, but I think 
I might try and make it look like a skate park type of thing. And then I actually got him for Christmas some little like tech deck things. So I might go dig those out of his Christmas and just put them on the cake for like a little extreme, extreme sports cake theme. So that wasn't the original plan, but my cake told me otherwise. <laughs> so uh, it's going to taste great, but it doesn't look very pretty right now. So we'll make it work. I'm going to frost it in the morning, so we'll figure it out tomorrow. I'm going to bed. It is. Ugh. Mm hmm. Yep. Good night. Good morning. It is party day. I have a million things to do and I slept way too late. I slept till 930. Um, but I mean, I still, I'm fine. <laughs> I have plenty of time, I think. Um, but the problem is I have to get out the little, um, extreme sports thing to do the cake that was unplanned. Um, uh, but it is somewhere in this pile. Holy moly. And it is like one of the very first things I bought. That's all Christmas gifts for my family, for nieces and nephews and cousins and all the people that we buy Christmas for. And so it is somewhere in there and I need to dig it out and it's going to be in the very bottom, very last box. I'm certain. So I better get to it, but I just want to check in and say, Hey, good morning. And I'll bring you along as I decorate the cake. Okay. So I got it out and there's the aftermath. Everything's on my bed now, but it's even better than I knew because I didn't remember it had ripsticks. And that is literally the, the one thing that he said he wanted was a ripstick party and there was no decorations for ripstick. That's why we went red and black and there's a red and black ripstick. That's so awesome. So we'll put in all these in a red and black bike. So we'll at least put these two things and we'll see what those skateboards look like on the top. That's awesome. Yay. You excited? Happy early birthday. Merry Christmas. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay i am going to put the base the fudge frosting on first and we're going to make it look like mud on the berm and then we're going to make like a trail and then like a little skate park area and aiden brought in a little rail so that we can use it for the skate park area Okay, it's done. It's definitely not the most awesome cake I've ever done. And the pink looks very red next to the red of the things. But um, I don't know what I just said. The red looks very pink next to the red things. That's what I meant to say if that's not what I said. <laughs> I think I said the red looks very, no, the pink looks very red. Yes. Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, so, and my grass doesn't look much like grass because I don't have my grass tip. But it is what it is, and it's done, and he's going to be very happy with it. So there we go. I'm going to set the table now and get the decorations set out, and then I'm ready for party. Okay. Go for it. This one first, I guess? Yeah, those are two different ones. They're two different ones. Okay. Mm hmm So who's this one? Kyle. Kyle. Okay. Thank you, Kyle. Nice to meet you. Can that, Kyle? Yeah. Oh, Does it come with flags? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nice, Lila. Thank you, Lila. Nice job. And I got a pencil. Money bags over there. There's a lot of little girls over there. <laughs> Nana, what are you going to do with all them little girls? You don't even know, do you? <laughs> Who do you think that's from? I'm guessing gravel. Yeah. Because it looks like her wrapping paper and her yep. bows. Yeah, her bows. <laughs> yep. You love her bows? Yeah, I like her bows. Oh, well, <laughs> excuse me. I've always told her they didn't care. <laughs> <laughs> now, one of your presents still hasn't come. So. They're stomping throwing cards. Wow. Wow. Two? How long will those last before you lose them all? What are they? Throwing cards, and you can also do magic with them. You get it. Thank you, Grandma. For chopping bananas and food. Is that what the video shows? The illustration? Oh, I don't know. I've seen people on TV. Oh. Oh. Let's go up there, Dutch. You can see. Can you see Aiden over there? Sit by your buddy Xander. <laughs> Kinsley. 
Hey, you tell stories at the open presence. Slow. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you gotta come here. Where's up here? He's just smiling. Valen's so dead face. Delusion. Oh, really? <laughs> Weird. <laughs> 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 yeah. Usually they play games and we all just sit at the table. I'm still waiting for the thing. It's like a little slide that falls. Oh, that's all. You'll have to use the That one, Kinsley. <laughs> Do you guys have elves in your house? No. Not me. Not me. Yeah. And my dog had an elf, and he wants his nap. And now he's in a jar. At school? Mm-hmm. He has to quarantine for 14 yeah, days? Yeah, if, if you don't find his match, he won't play with the oh. two then, then you had to wear a mask and so, so he can, he can, so he can play with them. Yeah, so we can and, play with the children. Mm-hmm. But we have, we have checked everywhere and no, 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 no one has fine. All right. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Aiden. Happy birthday to you. Dry blowing. No spit. <laughs> Yay! All right, I just wanted to pop on here and close out the night. Um, it's actually six minutes until midnight. Um, we had such a fun day. Um, Aiden's party went so well. Uh, we had a huge turnout and we just, it was so good to see our friends and family and he had a really good time with all of his buddies and our brother and sister-in-law ended up staying until almost midnight. I mean, they left about 1130. So, um, it was so good to catch up with them and spend time with them and just talk and hang out and, um, see the boys and let the boys play with the other kids and everything. So we just had a really, really good day. Um, and it is calling for snow tomorrow and I cannot stink and wait. I really hope it does. The chances are just really looking good. And, um, yeah, I hope it snows, but I hope it does not snow bad or stick to the roads because it's Lila's birthday party tomorrow. And I want to make sure that we make it to her parties, but I just wanted to kind of recap the day and say good night to you guys. And, um, we'll just catch back up tomorrow. It's going to be a long one tomorrow. It's going to be hard to edit. There's a lot of footage from yesterday and today and then adding tomorrow. So hope you're ready for a long vlog or hope you're enjoying this long vlog because you're going to be well into it by the time you see this portion of it. So anyway, I'm going to go to bed and get some rest.
to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Lila. Happy birthday to you. Yay, six You're years old. Over. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. Sunday. It is the end of Sunday and I'm just now getting on here and talking for the first time. Um, we woke up to snow coming down this morning and it has just snowed and snowed and snowed all day long. And so that's actually most of the footage that you've seen. Um, but we had church and then we went to Lila's birthday party. And then from the party, the kids all sled and had a lot of fun with their cousins. Um, and then we went to, um, we went to town. Sorry, I lost my train of thought for a second. We went to town and finished, finished Christmas shopping. I'm so stinking excited. All I have left to get is one gift card that we like had already checked out and we're walking out and Scotty said, did you get that gift card? Nope. Um, and then candy stock, candy stocking, stocking candy, <laughs> stocking candy. But everything else is done and I'm so stinking excited to be done. This is probably the earliest I've ever been done before. Scotty, are you done? Almost. Good. So um, this is, yeah, literally probably the earliest I've been done. But now I have like 4,000 presents to wrap. So anyways, um, I just wanted to jump on here and um, just actually talk for the first time in my today's vlog. And we're going to do advent calendars because we had family over until almost midnight last night. And it was so wonderful to spend time with them. Really enjoyed spending time with them. Um but we didn't do advent calendars. And so we're going to do um, Riley and Aiden's from yesterday and today. And then something Scotty doesn't know is his starts today. It? Your advent calendar. Uh, yeah. So you need to open 13. Are you ready? No. No. His is only 12 days. Oh. What do you think? Oh. This isn't as fun because it, it tells you what they all are. <laughs> <laughs> Coffees. That's cool. But you get a new coffee every day until Christmas. White Christmas, Hawaiian yeah. hazelnut, dark sky. Which I'm sure you won't drink it tonight. But if you open it tonight. Oh, there's decaf. Oh, there you go. You can have your first one tonight. Awesome. Yeah. So that was fun. He loves, loves coffee and loves trying new coffees. So, um, yeah, I thought that would be fun for him to have a new coffee every I'll day until to Christmas. Like right, whether I like it or not on all of them. Yeah, and then look them up. up and a phone thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would be cool. Then we could order. I've never heard of that company, but 
it was a reasonable price. A, a lot of them were like $24 for 12 of them. It's like $2 per K-cup? Heck no. So that one was a reasonable price. So anyway, I'll have to look into that company if they're good. Copper Yeah. So anyway, that was, that's going to be fun for Scotty. And this is fun for me, like to have all the kids and, and now Scotty get something new each day. So, all right, now I'll turn it around on the kids and they can open their advent calendars. I got a train. Nice. <laughs> yeah, his door is open. Well, Asher already opened that one last night when he stepped on it. Is it actually working? What is it? Oh, a clippy. Nice. I'm sorry that I lost. You just, it's like the cheapest little things in every little one. Yeah. I guess we got what we paid for with that one for sure. At least you get two days today. Oh, I forgot. They're open too. Yeah. Wait, what? Don't worry. I'm going to get this Yeah. Well, go ahead and build it. Takes Riley just as long to open all of hers. Nice. Is it a file? A buffer. Oh. That's kind of neat. It's like... Oh. I honestly don't know how to use it. Did you call it? Does it have a cover on it? Like plastic? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, it is a file. That's kind of neat, though. A file? Is it... File? Well... It's two different sides. File and buffer. Hmm. Oh, on the inside it says shine. Oh. I don't really know how that works. Yeah. That's kind of cool. Okay, Aiden, are you opening your next day? Uh, are you going to finish putting it together first? Okay. Okay, I'll All right, you ready to open the next day? Yep. Okay. Store. That's what you said before. I know, but this one looks different. All right, Scotty's going to try his coffee. He chose the decaf for tonight. I already took a drink a while ago. Though. Oh, is it good? Mm hmm And check out our Pikes Peak mug. We got that when we were in Colorado. Isn't that a gorgeous mug? I really like this guy. Yeah. It's, it's like a nice size and it's the handle's good and it's just pretty yep yeah this is, coffee has a good flavor to it for sure that's exciting mm -hmm. okay now aiden mm -hmm. you're welcome aiden's gonna show us his lego that he got so this is day 12 but it's kind of weird that that one's red that's cute not green it's the caboose most cabooses are red i know but it's just different that's cute and then day 13. This little shop. Oh, that's the bank. Oh, it is a bank. It's got a money sign on it, so. It's the bank. That's pretty cute. Very nice. And what else did you want to show them? Stuff for your from your birthday? Yeah. So the outfit he's wearing, he got from Grandma and Grandpa. Don't get this car. And then he got that Porsche from Dakota. Yep. His buddy Dakota. Put my little guy in there. It's pretty sweet. Mm -hmm. Pretty sweet. Very cool. I'm gonna go get my RC car. Okay. Okay, and then he got this little RC car. It's pretty little. You can see the size of my hand. But it goes up to 17 miles an hour. It's a zippy little thing. This little controller. Yeah. You can you wanna run it real quick? I don't know if it uh, is it? I don't know if it's charged. Okay. Okay. Remy doesn't like it, so he'll probably bark. I can't get a good. Put it on high. There you go. Mm -hmm. He's the very slow. Yeah. With the snow. We haven't swept or mopped because stuff just kept getting tracked in. Yeah. Okay.
Okay, so I'm sitting here editing the this vlog that you're watching and just realized I never closed it out. So um, I'm just going to say a really brief goodbye. Thank you for watching. I know this was a long one. It covered three days and a lot of stuff in my life. I know not everything probably interests everybody, but um, I know a lot of it will interest a lot of people. And also a lot of it is kind of my own personal video diary. I'm loving going back and watching these already um you know i've had my channel for almost two years now and so going back and watching ones i put up like two years ago has been a lot of fun too so i know in another two years i'm gonna watch this and be glad that i documented as much as i did so anyways um yeah i hope you're enjoying these vlogmases i am i missed editing them for three days so um i'm i'm gonna keep on the track of it because getting so far behind makes it a lot harder for me um but yeah, I, I have loved this and I am enjoying it. So thank you again for watching. Thanks for sticking it out with me for this really long one. And um, we'll see you tomorrow because I'll have two more days to add to it. Um, Monday and then Tuesday. So stay tuned and I love you guys. Merry Christmas. Mm -hmm.